My name is Oliver Queen. After surviving five harsh years on a mysterious island, I returned home to bring justice to those who would poison my city. To do that, I must become someone else. I must become something else. My name is Barry Allen, and I am the fastest man alive. While working as a forensic scientist, I had an accident that turned me into the impossible. Now I use my speed to fight crime and find others out there like me. I am The Flash. What up, bastards? I'm the main man, Lobo. My name roughly translates to he who devours your entrails and thoroughly enjoys it. When I was a kid, I fragged my entire planet for a high school science project, leaving me the last Zarnian alive. I'm now the best bounty hunter in the galaxy. Anyone says different, I'll frag them. Um, excuse me? What? Did you just say you killed your entire planet as a science project? Yeah, gave myself an A. Uh, I, I, I'm sorry to interrupt, but you're a comic book superhero? Maybe yeah, maybe no. Maybe what's it to you, Spandex? What I, what I think Barry's trying to say is we're kind of the heroes of the CW. You kind of don't fit the bill. Especially for a multi-season show with an exhausting 23 episodes a year run. What feats have you done? The hell are you talking about? I ain't that no feats, you creepy little- No, no, no. Feats with an A. Heroic deeds? Like Oliver once stopped the army of marauding soldiers hopped up on Mirakuru from destroying Starling City. And I once ran fast enough to stop a black hole from swallowing the Earth. Well, I once fragged Santa Claus on the orders of the Easter Bunny who was pissed Christmas was upstaging this holiday. See, that's kind of the opposite of what I mean. Lobo, is there anything, anything you care about? Well, the main man kind of has a soft spot in the soft spot where his heart should be for space dolphins. Excuse me, space dolphins? Yeah. That's just... lame, Lobo. Lame. I'm lame. Yep, kinda lame. Hey, puke-colored Hawkeye. You watch your father blow his brains out in front of you, and that somehow inspired you to fight crime with hunting equipment from Dick Sporting Goods. Arrows are cool. Aren't they? And the galloping gimp suit over here. You got super speed, time travel abilities, and your own personal IT department from Abercrombie and Pastage. And yet you've been beaten by people named the Thinker, Captain Cold, and the Rainbow Raider. Well, if Cisco names him, I don't really... You two losers can have your lame shows and your lame angsty teen network. The main man's out of here. Phenom's gives the shit I put up with. Maybe he's right. Maybe we are lame. Well, you are, at least. Hey! No, no, I'm, I'm sorry. We shouldn't judge. There's room for all sorts of comic book characters on our network. Hi. My name is Archie Andrews, and I'm from Riverdale. Shut, Shut the, the fuck, fuck up, up, Archie. This is the Simplistic Reviews Podcast. They talk movies. They talk TV. They really aren't able to talk about this ongoing Jesse Smollett controversy since they don't really understand what the hell is going on. I'm your announcer, Julie. And since Donald Trump has been exonerated from colluding with Russia, I'd like to personally apologize for all the insults I've thrown his way over the years. Wait what? Technically he's not exonerated? In that case, fuck that guy. Here are your hosts. Matthew Stewart, DJ Valentine, and Justin Polizzi. Hey kids, welcome to another alcohol-fueled episode of the Simplicity Reviews Podcast, but this time it's cool because it's spring break. For show purposes, I'm DJ Valentine. I'm joined by two guys that have won many a wet t-shirt contest. I'm stripping to pay for college Matthew Stewart, and I don't have a drinking problem because I can stop when I want. Justin Pelizzi, how are you guys doing? No, that is it, so it dead all on. I think out of all of them, that one is definitely <laughs> that was the most true drinking <laughs> problem. <laughs> yeah. The truest. We've, done, we've, been doing, we've been doing these shows for, what, about six years now? Yes. And only now have, have, we, finally, <laughs> have we finally... Have we finally... Lot, we've I mean, we've, to, been we've gone down to the truth. Zombies, vampires, zombies, vampires, uh, lawyers, uh, Supreme Court justices, doctors. Lawyers. Yeah, but uh, stripper and, a, and an alcoholic—that's pretty close to. Uh, <laughs> it's pretty close. Yeah, 
That We've been doing this want. a long time, kids. You know. <laughs> but and by that I mean, you know, six years. Mm-hmm. It's a long time. It's a long time. <laughs> It's this entire time we've been uh, stocking up on our anti-HIV drugs. Oh, thank birds. Christ! Yes. I think they gotta yeah. got that. I'm, I'm more I'm more worried about the measles and mumps. To be honest with you, because the measles. You can't tr- you, you can, well, you I love that band. The you can't, and the you mumps? can't trust those anti-vaxxers out there. There's too many anti-vaxxers out there. Isn't Jenny McCarthy an anti-vaxxer? Uh, she's a, she's an anti-vaxxer, right? With yeah, a lot of people are. Things. They don't believe in it. They think it gives their kids uh, the uh, the weird face. Didn't she do well, porn? They think they, think they <laughs> the weird face. <laughs> No, she did. Oh, Jenny McCartney. Yes. Take it back. I'm sorry. Yeah. Yes, she did a lot of t- terrible movies yes. and uh, terrible TV shows, mm-hmm. and uh, showed her tits. And now she's keeping uh, her kid from. Uh, <laughs> Please, you know. mom, mommy, she, she, I'm she, so she, sick. I'm so sick. She, I don't care. She, I don't care. Get you know what I had here. to do for Playboy? You know what I had to do to Hugh Hefner? I married a Wahlberg, and not even the good one. I married the yeah. other one. <laughs> yeah. Have you ever had a Wahlburger in your mouth? Because I have. <laughs> Tastes like shit. I took the cannoli. <laughs> you took. The, I, I left the Wahlburger and took the cannoli. Holy God! Leave, leave the Wahlburg. Let's leave him. I don't, I don't, I don't, there's no cannoli <laughs> in it. Let's leave him. Let's get the. Let's get the fuck out of here. Let's get the fuck out Jersey of here. Sucks. I mean, I'm not anti-vax, mm-hmm. but I'm pretty sure it's the water supply. So I, I think I'm anti-water. I think people should. Oh, you're drinking. anti-water. Uh-huh. <laughs> yeah, Conspiracy theories with Justin Belizzi. Anti-quenching of thirst. I figured out well, they how to in. kill everybody. <laughs> Tell them that the water is making them crazy. <laughs> Conspiracy yes, theories with just water. water. <laughs> I hate people. You know what they put in your water? I want them to all you know, die. Between water, it's water fluoride. contamination, ca- chemtrails. Guys, guys, guys. The seven people that say, live in the center say, of the earth. Let me just say. Yeah. Let me just get say. It out, get it out. One quick question for, for say both it, of you yeah, say, guys. It, say, it, say it. Say it. All right. Yes or no. Okay. Did yes. you not mm-hmm. play mm-hmm. Oregon Trail I, all the time? All the time. Oh, I liked it, man. I, my my okay. goal was try to being get. trying try doing that in real life. Okay, <laughs> yeah. without anti medicine. <laughs> okay, it was always a doomed expedition. I always you got always dysentery. Died. I always got dysentery. You always got dysentery. Somebody got yeah. typhoid. The, I didn't know what typhoid yeah, was. The, when I was the oxen o- always died, or the there the was oxen no evidence. Did you, okay, that question, question. Did, you the, did you cross? Did you cross the water, or did you pay for a ferry? What'd you do? No, I always did. I always like what it called ford forded the river. You forded the river. Forded oh, the you river. fucking living dangerous. Yeah, fjorded. I, I always fjorded the river. Jeez. But you always died, didn't you? You died. You, you lost a daughter. Didn't I don't know. You? You it lost was, a fucking it, it daughter, was all fuck. a matter of what the uh, Linux programmer wanted <laughs> to happen. <laughs> Linux was like, it's all what the government wanted daughter. to happen. Must kill yeah. child. <laughs> dysentery, man. Fucking dysentery. Fuck it, what the fuck was this? I still don't know what dysentery is. <laughs> dysentery is just when you shit your brains out till you die. Oh, wow. What a horrible way to go. So Is that in Ballad I mean, of Buster well, Scruggs? Or you can go get Mexican there? food. Because when the Ballad of Buster Scruggs had the Oregon Trail thing, I was like, oh, shit, Oregon Trail, the movie. <laughs> John Smith went to Chipotle. Now he has dysentery. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, ye. I will take thy uh, sofritas bowl. You know, you know what they should do? They should make Oregon Y'all Trail for today. Oh, man. With, like, you know, like Trump in there and everything oh. and anti-vax oh. people. The, tr- the and... Trump Trail? The Trump Trail. Yeah. The camp- so it's called the campaign trail. No, John Smith blew his brains out because he couldn't take it anymore. <laughs> Alex Jones has lost it. Can't Alex Jones. I do. I want. A, I want. I want an updated Oregon Trail. It's like you're going Alex down Jones the trail. Alex Jones is saying these child actors are child actors. <laughs> my yak is dead. My, <laughs> it's waving somebody a Somebody killed my yak. You killed my yak. You think the Oregon Trail of today would have like Mexicans on a wall? No, no, no. I, I guarantee Depends you one thing. It probably has some Vin Diesel in it. It probably would have like, you know, Fast and Furious LA. is kind of like the modern day Oregon Trail. But it's like instead of Oregon, oh, it's okay. like L.A. And the Tyrese is there. The L.A. Yeah. Trail. The L.A. Okay. Trail, yeah. When is that going to be in space? When is Fast and Furious? Yeah, when do they go to you know, now, Fast probably, and the Oxygenless? <laughs> I don't I know if you've like seen one. that Hobbs and Shaw trailer. It's pretty close to being in space. A car is flying in it. So they're like one step away. <laughs> I don't know. No, I, don't, I hate uh, that name. Hobbs. Hobbs? Yeah. Is it Hobbs? Hobbs. It's a it's a it's yeah, a oath to tango and cash. That's what I'm is for it. It's, it makes me a, think of uh, it makes me think of Calvin and Hobbs. That's what I was gonna oh, say. Yeah. That's the his name. Book, what do you want his name to be? Yeah. You know, it's, I don't yeah. know, not Hobbs. Garfield <laughs> and Garfield and Doug Friends funny? the movie. Doug Funny. <laughs> hey funny. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> funny and Garfield. 
I fucked Patty Mayonnaise the other day. Hey, funny, I fucked Patty Mayonnaise. Mayonnaise all over her face. <laughs> There's a reason why they call her Mayonnaise. Oh, my God. Don't you get it? Roger Klotz, sexual just, deviance. I was just saying, I would, I would, you I know why it. Skeeter was called Skeeter, right? Oh, oh yeah. Skeet, oh. Skeet, Skeet, Skeeter <laughs> Valentine, my cousin. Skeet, Skeet, yeah. Hong Kong. Skeeter Valentine. <laughs> We know we know way too much about yeah. the TV show Doug. By the way, I, don't think, I know a lot yeah. about Doug. <laughs> Doug is great. You ever seen? Yeah, I can sing the song for you. Do, 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 Banging do, 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 on the trash can. Oh no, no, no! That's <laughs> not it. That's not okay. Drumming on the street light. Right. light. <laughs> One little voice is calling me, calling me, <laughs> calling me, calling me. One Doug little funny. voice is calling me, <laughs> calling me, calling me. All right, uh, let's catch up with what we missed in a segment we like to call <laughs> "Can You Dig It." Can you dig it? Can you dig it? Can you dig it? Can you dig it? This is where we go over a couple sub- subjects of things that we missed uh, since we've been on last. Hmm. Uh, James Gunn is back, guys. Uh, can you dig yeah. it? Speaking of firing. <laughs> What? Who was speaking of fire? Uh, on old cylinders? I don't know. <laughs> sure. Oh, because a gun. Oh, oh yeah, because he's, he's, he's a yeah, finger gun. I mean, really? Uh, come, come on, on Dad. Yeah, <laughs> I'm I thought sorry. I thought we did. This, I thought we've done this long enough to understand that. I'm sorry. It, it was such a cliche. I nothing. missed it. I got a theory. <laughs> I think James Gunn knew he was coming back when he yeah. got told he was fired. Yeah. But why he was would like, he? <laughs> he should have passed that message back. on to Dave Batista before he. Uh, the poor Dave well, they never did. They can't let that stuff out, man. Because then people will hear. They they said, James, listen, we're gonna let you go. Yeah, we're but gonna you're come gonna back. Let yeah. everyone calm the fuck down. Yeah, and then they'll forget about it, and then we'll say, hey, he's back. And then everything. Go do your again. killer Superman movie if you want. <laughs> give me, a, give yeah. me your fucking Superman movie. <laughs> give me a motherfucking Superman movie. Maybe they should have just made James Gunn the head of Warner movies now. This well, well, speaking of which, Ken Sujihara steps down from Warner Brothers. Oh, <laughs> man, what a segue. Can you dig that? that? Is... What a... Yeah, I could dig that. Oh, he was right. digging something. Oh, with Brett Ratner, apparently. Man, yeah. shrimp pans. Well, the old and, rat, huh? What do you call him? Shrimp pans? What would you call him? Classic uh, director of hits of X-Men 3. And oh, Rush yeah. Hour 2. And Rush Hour 3. 3. And Rush Hour. And, and when Rush it talks. Hour. <laughs> And Buddy Talks. And uh, the Heavy D video. And uh, before... Yeah. Oh, yeah. And what's that? And Yo, Yo MTV Raps. I think it's Yo MTV. some episodes. <laughs> Brett Ratner, folks. Brett Ratner. Oh, he's got, he's had a storied career. Brett Ratner you know, reminds me of the def- Fire Festival guy if he was a director. That's essentially oh, what yeah, Brett, I can see that. reminds me of. He's like if, uh, he's like if uh, Dan Blazarian and <laughs> Brett Ratner like, had if a Dan Blazarian really fucked up <laughs> shitty The Fire kid. Festival guy made a baby. It'd be Brett Ratner. Yeah, baby, fucking yeah. I mean, but it works so well because it could be anybody. Any combination of those three could yeah. be one make, of the same. They would any combination of those three would make the other. I mean, yeah. If Red Red and the Fire Festival guy had a kid, it'd be Dan Blazarian. It'd be Dan Blazarian. <laughs> I got great. accused of looking like Dan Blazarian the other day. You should have said you were him. You should have said, "Hey, come back to my mansion." I should have. I, I think it was a little bit of a missed opportunity. Oh, but man. he obviously saw that I was not Dan Blazarian. <laughs> Guys, Google Dan Blazarian. <laughs> Is yeah. it Dave? I don't know yeah. his first name. Go- D- Google Matthew Stewart and Dan Blazarian. Coincidence? <laughs> Never seen him in the same place. Uh, Never so, seen him in the same place. So you think this is a good uh, step for Warner Brothers? Just in seeing that it's been a uh, kind of a rocky ship, yeah. kind of a left and right ship. Uh, got a, got a couple good movies. Got I a, think it's well since he's came movies. on board. I, f- I feel like uh, Warner Brothers got a little bit stale since mm-hmm. this <laughs> young, mm-hmm. young Padawan took over. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Now he's padawaning uh, the uh, pad- interns, <laughs> <laughs> which you don't do. I don't. I don't understand some people, man. Like, you're 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 fucking running Warner Brothers, yeah. and what you're gonna like touch do that? women yeah. and say shit like? Apparently he seriously he gave especially roles now out it's to like women you know it's gonna banging, come out so or a girl he was banging so yeah it's just it, it, it's it's funny because when I heard the story I'm like oh yeah like old Hollywood. <laughs> like every other producer. Ever. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, like, yeah, it's like, hmm. Yeah, but this guy made shit movies. So. <laughs> you gotta have a better runner's yeah. man than this kid's with Sarah Sujara. <laughs> I mean. <laughs> yeah, you, be- you better start making some good, if you make some good movies, and people might go, like, ah, oh, come on, let the work speak for itself. It's like, no, nobody's flooding fucking suicide. Can't Sujara, the guy behind this guy. Justice League. <laughs> 
Yeah. <laughs> Suicide, Squad. Suicide Squad kisses B her. versus S. <laughs> Batman v Batman Superman. Batman v Superman. Speaking of which, uh, Zack Snyder. The Robocop remake. Oh, yeah. That one, too. We're not going to let that one go. <laughs> Zack Snyder says that uh, Batman and people who think Batman shouldn't kill need to grow up. Oh, and, shut uh, the fuck up. Know, Batman kills. His ass. Wasn't that what it was? Or something? Oh, yeah, what is it? Batman needs to grow up? He said that people who think that Batman kills uh, uh, be, or against pe- Batman killing need to grow up. Can you dig that? Who said that? You can't, Zach Zach. Snyder, Zachary Snyder. Oh, Zach Snyder said yeah, that. He also he dropped a whole bunch of uh, grow up? what his Justice League movie would have been. It was stuff. He, he essentially said like, "You all need to fucking grow up because fucking Batman kills, so deal with it." Okay, deal with but it. I'm past him. that. I'm over that. Yeah. Yeah. Deal yeah. with it. Deal with your hero who's not real. I'm the Avatar. People. You gotta deal with it. Yeah. That's such a. Hey movie. man, stop. <laughs> you oh, know, God. I think it most- just shows you how understanding he was of these characters. <laughs> <laughs> he really had I his mean, finger listen, on the pulse of I, I've said it before. Mm. You know, 89. It's my thing, man. That's your, that's, yeah. that's your jam? I'm having a hard week. I'll turn that on. That's my jam. Batman does murder um, in 89. He kills a lot of people in 89. Batman murders quite a bit. <laughs> yeah. Quite a he bit. Blew, he blew up an uh, entire factory with human beings in it. Yeah, I mean, they were there late night working. <laughs> yeah, they were working on that on that Brand X. They were Brand working on X. That, uh, <laughs> um, they were and then on that returns, returns, he blew up. He blew up a guy he, with he a bl- bomb. Yeah, he put a bomb in his pants. He put pants a bomb in a fat guy and blew him up. <laughs> yeah, and he blew him down to the sewer. But you know, when I was like eight, I was like, you know, that's not bad, man. And I grew to understand <laughs> that. That's not bad, well, man. That's not bad, man. Batman doesn't kill, yeah, right? Right. Batman doesn't kill, which is a great... It's a great thing for a character. Yes. A comic book character. I don't kill, right? Mm-hmm. But I also don't have any powers. I'm just a man. Mm-hmm. But I will, and it would be so easy to walk around with a gun them feel to like shoot they people. Die. I li- right? I, I, I did like what they... Somebody had so, said on Twitter that, like... Uh, they were re- they were putting a scene where the Joker is being interrogated by Batman in the Dark Knight, and the Joker's like, "I'm gonna have you break your one rule." And then, as I said, Batman rips the Joker's head off. End of movie. That's why Batman doesn't kill because right. there's no well, story when he does. Yeah, there's no story. Exactly. No, there's no story. Because Batman could kill you whenever he wants. He just chooses not to. Yes. But understand this too. Let's look at the Avengers. Right, Age of Ultron. Right. A lot of people died in that movie. <laughs> oh, because yeah. of people that. Died. Yes. Yeah. They had there was, to create there was a, a whole fallout wall. to yeah. that. Yeah. Right. So at least Marvel was like, listen, all right, look, we'll create a look, story over this. Yeah, look, we'll, we'll we know people off. die. <laughs> people die. But the, the fact that the matter is, and Spider-Man doesn't kill people no. any, anyways as no. well. No. But Batman always, yes. No one died except for a couple movies. I don't have to save you. Movies, by the way. <laughs> but here's the thing. We're over that. Yeah. I'm over that. That was the time period. Yeah, it, was 20, it was 25 years ago. You know, yeah. I... Still get what I get from that. It's it's the greatest flashlight for me I've ever used. Mm. You know, I fuck that thing all the time. <laughs> and the thing is, the thing is, that's not bad, man. No. I get that. I can understand that. I have these two worlds going on. I love the movie. I love Batman. It's not really Batman. You got oh. Zack over here, right? Yeah. Zack's gonna, he's gonna do the impossible. He's gonna create the JL, right? He's gonna put the JL on there. Yeah. Remember what he said? Let me let me just let me go back a little bit. Oh, here we go. Remember here what he we said go. About Marsh Manhunter. Oh God. Yeah, I remember that. Remember that yeah. the leader essentially of the Justice League. Uh, yeah. Yeah. But come He's on. essentially the oracle of the Justice League. Tells him where to go. What's yeah. going on? Yeah, he, a fucking psychic. He keeps keeps he keeps Batman chill. Keeps Superman chill. Yep. 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 Right? Yep. Yep. Right. Mm-hmm. He he's he's he. There is no Justice League. Without the marsh, right? Apparently there is. And the thing is, <laughs> a really bad the thing is, according to Zack Snyder, Snyder, yes, <laughs> can't have him in there. It's not a part of it. Not my world. So that just showed me right then and there. He doesn't now, give a shit. How many years has it been? He hasn't oh. touched. Hasn't done anything. No. Nope. Right. It's been. He's been missing for a while. He's right? doing what that. Uh, uh, he's doing that. Uh, he's bringing it back. He's doing, bringing it back. Doing some arc, architect movie or some it. crap. I forget the name of the movie. Yeah. Don't 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 shove it down. Did he said something about if I remember. Correct me if I'm wrong. <laughs> didn't he say like uh, Mar- Marsh was a was a pussy and he's like he he tried to be a cool cool guy talking and he was like throwing like fuck this. Uh, he's a pussy. <laughs> he doesn't need to be in the Justice League, which was like crazy to hear. Martian Manhunter, a man who can shapeshift into anything, and his only weakness yeah. is fire. <laughs> 
No, but yeah, but yeah, but he yeah, his we he has but he has a weakness of fire. That, that's 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 pussy shit right there. Batman has a weakness of he bullets. Have, <laughs> I know, but yeah, but he's so muscular. <laughs> by the way, Superman has lots of muscles too. By Batman eighty nine mm. and Batman Returns is returning to the theaters. Ooh. Well, yeah, well, it is, it is Batman's what birthday this week? Eightieth. Like yes, it is. Yeah. 80th birthday. 80th birthday. So I will be going to the theater again to see Batman 89. I've seen it many times in the theater. I mm. hope it's an original 35. You know, I hope it's not just like a Blu ray copy. Um, <laughs> Here's yeah, the Blu ray of. <laughs> Here's the Blu ray that you could have watched in the comfort of your own home. Now you gotta uh, sit with assholes love... and watch it. Hey! <laughs> yeah, hey, you gotta sit with a bunch of assholes who were like, Batman sucks. Like, ah! <laughs> There's nothing like seeing original print. And I've. Luckily, have gotten to see original print of 89 in the theater. It's fantastic. It's dirty. It skips frames. It's, it's all over the fucking place. But I'll tell you what. I'm going to enjoy it. But I know. We all know. Batman doesn't kill. I grew up on the animated series. Oh, Batman didn't kill. Kevin yeah. Conroy's okay. Batman. Yeah. Joker. So when Batman's done right, he's done right. <laughs> Transformers Romance, speaking of which, uh, and more Bayham, uh, promised by the Vin of Insurer. Can you dig it? Bayham? What, what, so what is this again? More Transformers? So essentially, the Transformers was working out pretty good. They said, fuck and, that. And, uh, they made actually good Transformers movie, and then D. Bonaventura, who's best friends with Michael Bay, was like, eh, didn't make yeah, a billion a dollars, so now they're going to fuck, and uh, we're going to put more Bayham in it. The sequel. Yeah. To Mumblebee. Yeah. Uh, so, so Bumble, know, Bumblebee didn't do well? It didn't make a billion dollars because everybody was tired of the last five Transformers movies, so it didn't make uh, what the well, other ones yeah. made, mm. even though it was a better film. So Bayham's <laughs> the answer, huh? Yeah, according to him. D. Bonaventura. Is, is who's Michael Bay producers. coming back to? Uh, Fuck, I hope not. Jesus. Don't even get me started on this fucking subject. I'm going to leave it to you well, guys. What I don't if, want what to want to rant. Travis, Travis Knight stayed on, but they added more Bayham. <sighs> I'm, I'm going to step back and let you guys discuss this because I do not want to go on a uh, rant here. Continue. I don't know. I haven't seen a Transformers movie since I think the first Transformers movie. Bumblebee is worth your time. Bumblebee is essentially with is what Transformers should have been. <laughs> Everything else sucks. Yeah. Sure. <laughs> so we're just going to dump that off and go back to how it how was. It was yes. Well, go back to go back to billion dollar movies. You know What's, what's the problem with Lowest that? common denominator. Why, why not? Fuck it. Oh, well, yeah. I mean, yeah. It's a bunch of fucking idiots. It's, it's, just, it's just proving the fact that this uh, whole world needs to be sterilized. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not going to go on a rant. I'm just going to move on. This, is, An- this, this subject angers me. I, I don't, sterilization is the key. I don't want to flip out. All right, here we go. Um, something good. John Wick trailer. Good, good talk. Good talk on I, that. I don't want to get into it. John Wick trailer. Can you dig it? <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to be angry. I don't want to be angry. Yeah. Yeah, that movie's going to be pretty cool. I like it. John Wick 3, man. Yeah, it, 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 I, it like, is what I it is. like John Wick. You know, they're fun flicks. They are. You know? John- I mean, this this could take place in space and I'd be okay. <laughs> John see, Wick in space. That's what I want to see in space. People keep asking I mean, me if I'm an astronaut. <laughs> yeah, I'm thinking I'm an astronaut. <laughs> yeah, I like that this wick that. isn't going to fall because there's no gravity. <laughs> there's no fire. You want to go after astronaut John Wick. <laughs> Wick. <laughs> you motherfucker. You wanna you wanna go to war? Astro Yaga. Or you wanna give me a space suit? <laughs> These I like movies. The fact that this uh, trailer was on the heels of the announcement of the uh, Bill and Ted movie. Right. Which is it's funny because uh, I was saying this on Twitter that like Keanu Reeves back in like '99 it was like oh he's gonna be remembered for the Matrix and now it's coming to the point where I think he might be remembered for Bill and John Ted Wick. or John Wick I before think, the Matrix. Yeah. <laughs> The, the Matrix feels like an afterthought it's, now. It, yeah. yeah. Because even as cool as The Matrix was and groundbreaking <clears throat> as The Matrix was, I don't think he was cool in The Matrix. I think The Matrix as a, no. as a concept was cool. Yeah. The concept, but he is cool as shit as John cool. Wick. <laughs> like everybody's like, yeah. oh, fuck, that John Wick movie? And it don't matter Which who you are. Remaking. Black, white, Puerto Rican, Haitian. It don't matter. Well, well, if you see that remaking, John, remaking, John remaking Wick post, you're like, oh, I got to see that John Wick movie. <laughs> John Wick's killing me, bro. Got a dog in it. He's <laughs> got a dog. Right. Yeah, it's a, it's a, it's a, they're solid uh, little action pieces to go see, and sometimes absurd, and it understands yeah. that. Yeah. Um, you know, we got the, it. we got the horse. Yes. Yeah. The we horse. got the riding of the horse in this one, <laughs> and uh, what, what's, what's not, what's not, not great about that? Oh, it's gonna be fun. It's gonna be fun stuff. Halle Berry joined on to the movie without even reading the script. That's when you know. 
the guys want to be yeah. in. Yeah. <laughs> That's want to be there. It's John Wick. John Wick, it's man. John Wait, did you join Wick. without reading the script? Oh. It's got Angelica Hughes, for Christ's sake. <laughs> or yeah. Tisha's in it. <laughs> yeah, I know. It's going to be another fun one. Yeah, they, that's they, to be a fun movie. They know what they're doing know. with that shit right there. See, I'll go see that, but I won't go see a Transformers fucking film. No. So they I, can do whatever they again, want. Again, I would recommend watching Bumblebee and forget pretending the other ones never fucking happen. <laughs> Do you Just need to see the other mind. ones for Bumblebee that make sense? Uh, does uh, does she fuck that uh, Bumblebee? Oh, she fucks the shit out of it. Oh my god, it's like two hours. Ooh, uh, next, <laughs> next one. <laughs> Once upon a time in Hollywood trailer. Can you dig that? Yeah. Yeah, it was different. Yeah. It was a it's a different type of trailer yeah. though, you, w- which w- I can dig. Yeah. You, did you? Is, yeah, you yeah, got hesitant. Like you didn't. You weren't uh, completely in on no, it. No, it's it's gonna be good. It's it's gonna be good. You know, I like it. Are you guys a little sick of the whole thing with uh, Tarantino doing like the ninth movie from Quentin Tarantino? Wait, because he's, he's supposed been to doing be that since... I, I, know, I, I know. I know. I know. But so, is the tenth movie gonna be his end? Yes, probably. Is he doing ten and that's it? Hon- yeah. Honestly, movies. if I was him, I would end because his filmography is pretty pretty good. Hateful Eight is probably for me yeah. or Death Proof. Or like that's a good box set, right? Yeah, there. we yeah. get stuff. Ten the, movie box set. Like Death Proof. If Death Proof is his weakest movie, that's better than like ninety percent of the movies that are out there. <laughs> so. I love Death Proof, guy. I like, I like it's everything. Yeah, yeah. I'm just, I'm, I'm just saying. Tarantino. If his weakest fair, yeah, if you had to pick the weakest Tarantino movie, what would it be for you? The weakest? Yes. Oof. It would be that. Yeah. It'd probably be Death yeah. Proof be, or Hateful Eight for I, me, I, I, or I, maybe I would probably say Kill Bill Volume Two is probably. Oh, I love Kill Bill Volume Two. That's where you get the Superman speech with fucking Carradine. I know, but yeah, no, and there's so much hype around that when I came out originally. Oh, I was so pumped, yeah. so yeah. fucking pumped. I don't know. I'm I'm a horror guy, so I like Death Proof more. So, so you, see, I, don't I prefer and I like Planet, I like Planet Russell Terror, where he had nothing to do with it, but he was just like kind of there. Know. Well, he was a rapist. Yeah, he was. He was just, he was a, he was yeah. around, but uh, his his <laughs> dick get his fell balls off. shot off or something. Yeah, yeah. Well, his dick like fell off because it was like he was breathing oh, yeah. gas and yeah. shit. Didn't Fergie get attacked by zombies in Planet Terror? I gotta rewatch Planet Terror. I haven't seen Planet Terror in a while. Planet Terror is fun. It's a fun movie. It's not their fun movies. Yeah. yeah. But what's about a time in uh, I wish Hollywood? They did more of those. I, 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 for some reason, when I watch a Quentin Tarantino like trailer, it's just like it feels, and I know it's purposely made to feel like this, old. This one was like far a, different than a lot of the other ones, though. But it just, it was, it just it was, his it, movies feel like movies. Yeah. It, 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 this is me, who's a Marvel fan. Marvel movies or just movies in general that are even, even sucks. Ja- Marvel's car. Even John Wick movies, they're, they're just <laughs> this very. This guy sucking in my dick. But they're very clean. Uh, Quentin Tarantino movies yeah. feel like old, gritty, like dirty, dirty yeah. Hollywood. You know, it's like, oh wow, I, I, I love that. Forgot that yeah. feeling where you watch like a trailer, like oh yeah. shit, this looks like a like an actual. Even the pacing of that trailer, um, I you know it. If it was somebody else, if it was not Tarantino, I'd mm-hmm. be like, huh. That's interesting. Mm-hmm. Yeah. But I knew what I was getting into. And when I watched that trailer, the pacing's like back and forth and, and you know, the, the interview in the beginning. And it the, seems like a TV show than a movie. Hmm. Uh, I don't know. I, don't know. I, think, he's, I think he's creating something. It kind some of vibed to me a little bit, you know. I think he's going to create an interesting experience because I kind of got that from the trailer. Yeah. I was like, well, this is going to be an experience to go see this film. Well, well you're going to get everything. You get Bruce Lee, you got Charles Manson. That guy who does, who's doing Kate. Bruce Lee's fucking The guy phenomenal. who looks like Bruce Lee. Fu- that, that motherfucker is Bruce it Lee. It scares me. Ghost. I'm like, what the f- Did they crop in Bruce Lee into this fucking movie? I dug him up. <laughs> they dug I him up know. and reanimated it's Bruce Lee. They dug his ass up. <laughs> Wake All up, you have Bruce. to do is get some fishing string. You'd be okay. Yeah. yeah. Well, pa- puppeteer, well puppeteer his ass. Who gives a fuck? <laughs> oh, a I'm waiting for... Maybe Tarantino will do a movie. His 10th movie will just be a bunch of dead people he dug up. And he's like, I'm doing a movie with nothing but dead people. What happened to the Real Tarantino dead Star Trek shit? What happened? I was so ah, hyped for that. that. Well, they gave it to that woman, though. No? I don't know what happened. I literally don't know what happened. The last thing I heard, Chris uh, Pine was out or something. And that shit was hot of, and heavy for a second. Yeah, I was like, oh, I'm all in on a Star Trek Quentin Tarantino. If I can't get Aaron Sorkin, he's the next yeah, best fucking did, thing. So, yeah. I think what they did was they were having their, their essentially, their version of a, a Joker film. And remember, there was two Joker oh, like films. Oh, like a standalone. Exactly. Like a standalone. Uh, oh, yeah. yeah. Which I they still eventually that. killed off. Why? They killed it off. <laughs> but um, the, the the Star Trek film, I think, kind of, I think his got killed off as well when they Why? put the uh, that, that lady in, uh, the director. Um, who, who, she was who, taking over. Who makes the stupid decision to say, you know what I don't want to see? I don't want to see a Quentin Tarantino Star Trek movie. I'm not, well, that's the studio talking. What a fucking bunch of... 
dicks. Motherfuckers. They're fucking assholes. Not to say that they made a bad choice with the female. No, I don't. I don't care. She can do her. Make two of them. I don't care. Make hers and make his. Don't make not two. make his. I don't understand what the. I don't care. Maybe he, maybe he's waiting for that to be his tenth movie. That's what I'm saying. Hopefully that's the tenth one. If it was, if it is, maybe if, if he ends end. on Star Trek, he start and kill Billy and uh, dropping fucking uh, Wrath of Khan lines. So I mean, he's a Star Trek fan. But anyway, I, I'm I'm, right. I'm getting I'm a Star Trek fan. So I don't sorry. know. I'm getting all listen, fanboy. I'm sorry. We're we'll moving to the next one. Uh, listen, you fucking you Star Trek movie. hipster. Sneak, sneaking of uh, things that one of us is uh, super addicted to and is a super fan of. Uh, James Bond producers want a Scott as the next James Bond, according to reports. Uh, can you dig that? A Scottish person. A Scott? Hey, not, 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 not Scott Farkas. Uh, no. <laughs> a actual not, Scottish not person. Not Scott Speedman? Not Scott Speedman. Not, uh... How about Scott Stapp? Scott Stapp is going to be the next James Bond. What do you feel about that? Can you dig that? Can you take me higher? What about Scott Seed? <laughs> Scott Skiles? Uh, Scott, Bacula. <laughs> Scott Bakula? Scott Bakula? Scott Quantum yeah, leaping. There you go. There's a lot of there's a lot of good Scots in there. <laughs> Scott Bio, Bayo. Bio? I'm, I'm assuming the, the, when I, I when I heard this, I kind of googled Scottish actors, and the what, first one that came up oh, was like, uh, James Sean McAvoy, Connor. and I was like, yeah. But he's he's kind of short. Like James, well, not like short matters in movies, but I don't know if he's Bond material. I like James who's McAvoy. A lot. Scotsman. Say what? No. I feel like I know more Irish actors than I know Scottish actors. Yeah, the, the, the biggest one I saw was James McAvoy. And I was like, oh, I mean, he's he's good. <laughs> I like do, him as an actor. Need, do I just you, don't do know if he's Bond. Do you need a big actor? Or do you go well, kind Who's of like... the biggest Scottish actor you can think of all time? Sean, Sean Connery. Is Sean Connery Scottish? Sean Connery. Huh, interesting. Yeah, he is. <laughs> interesting. Yeah. Uh-huh. That's about the only one I can think of. It's <laughs> on my head. Bring, huh. bring back Sean Connery. Sean Connery. So here's what I'm thinking. Oh, okay. here, here we go. Here comes the wheels. I can hear them turning. No, they're they're listening. They're clearly listening to the show. Yes, obviously. Obviously. Yeah. obviously. They are the one listener that listens to the show. Yes. I said, <laughs> you need to find somebody who's not on the radar, mm. very low key, mm. not well known, mm-hmm. just like they've done before. Mm. Right. Now, Connery was doing uh, stage plays. He was doing yeah. theater prior to uh, Bond role. Uh, Craig did a few films as yeah. well, um, yeah, but not well known. Um, probably the most well-known actor, maybe maybe more? At, at, well, at Pierce Brosnan was pretty be, popular. Pierce Brosnan was... Well, Pierce Brosnan was like Remington Steele, so he Remington was kind of, Steel, yeah, kind of sort of tailor made. Here's the thing. Uh, Roger Moore played Bond before he played Bond. In Even fact, in The Saint, he right? He played Bond. No. No. He actually played James Bond in a uh, spoof uh, on a late night show uh, where he actually said the words, you know, I'm James Bond. Oh. And they made fun of him. And this is, uh, I'll have to dig it up for you. You might, you might, I don't think it's on YouTube. I might, I'll throw it up on there. I'm sure mm. we get taken down. But it's, uh, it's well, a fun yeah. little watch. Um, but I think Moore was more a um, household name before he took on the role. Um, and same with uh, Timothy Dalton. He did a lot of uh, Shakespeare plays and whatnot, so he low key. And I think, you know, everyone jumps on the gun when uh, uh, there needs to be a Bond, a new Bond, and they pick out every actor that everyone's ever heard of, but they never look at the little guy who's come upcoming. Do you like want to risk before. your Bond franchise with the little with the guy you've never heard of? You want to risk it? But, oh yeah, well, why not? Everybody why else not? was small though, at the same time. You, I mean, you find a young that. Scottish actor that maybe has done a few, I don't know, shows here and there, uh, maybe a movie or two. You don't need, you don't need, you know. Like, remember Hugh Jackman? Everyone was saying that Hugh Jackman should be a Bond and stuff like. Are you crazy? He's not. Yeah, he's not. Nuts. He's not the uh, Bond. ish He's too. He has like I'm two levels. Bond should material. He has Logan level and he has uh, Oklahoma level. He's not really. Yeah, but and then and then you have uh, John Luther. Are you crazy? He's too old. You need somebody young. Get somebody thirties. Hey man, black yeah, don't crack, baby. It just almost still looks like he's twenty something. Yeah. Okay, but you need you need you need a young <laughs> young guy who's going to take the franchise for a couple of years. You know, it could happen. Yeah. I, I, I'm, need I'm, a few years. I'm very interested to see what they do. But I mean, they I, 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 they'll be okay. Don't trust me. I feel I feel like they'll be okay. <laughs> they'll be fine. The, the, They've only been doing the, it the for fifty obviously fucking years. Know what they're doing. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, okay, next one. Uh, Maisie Williams and apparently everybody in the movie doesn't know anything about the New Mutants movie. Uh, can you dig that? 
You don't know when oh, it's man. coming out. What happened to it? Where it is? Maybe it was a mutant. It was a mutant trick. <laughs> yeah, they were supposed to do uh, reshoots. Apparently, and no one knows when it's going to happen. Oh God, that movie so. was supposed to come up with last year or this year? Last year in April oh, of geez. last year. Man, bad. <laughs> bad, bad, bad. That's not good. Man. Yeah, not good, huh? Not good. Well, well hey, at least we're getting that dark phoenix that film. film that dark was phoenix, interesting. Jesus me. Christ. Uh, not the light phoenix. Not to be confused with light phoenix. Yeah, no, no, no. no. Darf. <laughs> you mean the movie Darf, where they spoil the death of a major character in the beginning Darf. of the second trailer? <laughs> yeah, well, yeah. Well, I had to say, this isn't your mother's X Men. Oh, yeah, God. it's not your this father's. Ain't your daddy's X Men. Nobody's X Men. Nobody in your fucking family's X Men. Um, Nobody wants these X Men anymore. <laughs> Uh, Obviously, she was con- contractually having to be in that film. Yeah, yeah. Maisie Williams. And, and she played like she Harrison care. Ford. Oh, said, kill me. <laughs> kill, oh, you're talking about uh, Jennifer out. Lawrence? Get me off this plane. I don't want to be in kill this movie me. anymore. Please kill me. <laughs> just just want to act like I'm pissed off at everybody and angry all the time. I don't want to be here. I don't want to be on solo. I don't care. I, could, I uh, <laughs> don't care. <laughs> I'm not Jennifer Lawrence. I don't care. I don't care. <laughs> She jumps out of the uh, jumps out of the drain. He did a Peter Pan of the, off of this river. damn right here. Uh, <laughs> Side note: A lot of people don't realize there is a sequel to The Fugitive. Yeah, U.S. Marshals. Yeah, it's not U.S. Marshals. Robert Downey Jr. as Which a spoiler is, alert bad guy at, in that movie. Yeah. Oh spoiler no! Alert, spoiler alert! Spoiler alert! There you go. I, I, I like U.S. Marshals, but I think uh, I think uh, people should uh, watch The Fugitive and U.S. Marshals. Do a double feature. <sighs> I don't yeah, know. That's, that's the movie where night. Tommy Lee Jones beats Wesley Snipes in a fist fight. Uh, I think it's a little bit of a sense. Uh, uh, this belief I cannot really. Uh, I think I don't it's just know. crazy. Yeah, I think you should just accept it for what it is, and uh, it happened. It happened. Tommy yeah, Lee it Jones, happened. get over it. Eighty-five-year-old Tommy Lee Jones beats Wesley Blade Snipes in a fist fight. Well, he was more like you know, he was more like seventy-two there. Okay. Uh, <laughs> and Wesley Snipes was a lot heavier back then because <laughs> yeah. he was paying his taxes. Yeah, yes. he was eating. He was eating up trough. That's true. Uh, what have you? What you've seen from the Hellboy movie so far? Can you dig it? Eh, it looks cool. Yeah, I mean, it's Hellboy, right? Yeah, I mean, something about it feels yeah. wrong to me. I like that's rated know. R. It's rated R, right? They're going. They're I going don't know if R. they've rated it yet. I think the rumor is it's going to be. Believe rated. it. It's coming it out like in two weeks. It better rate it. It's I don't know. If, you gotta check that out. I don't know if it's rated yet. I don't, I, yeah, it's, it's rated R. It's rated R. It's rated R. It's rated R. Yeah. yeah. All right. Listen, a guy get a shotgun to his head in the trailer. Oh, yeah, you're right, you're right. Yeah, I forgot about that. Yeah, yeah there you go. That, there's your heart rating right there. I, but, I just don't you know, know. Something about it feels just, uh, wrong. Is it because is it because you're so attached to the Guillermo del Toro? It's probably why. Like, it's, I, don't, it, it, I don't want... I don't... I don't want the Neil Marshall movie, which is going to be a lot better, everyone. It, it literally looks like it's the same... Th- like... W- it literally looks like it's the same movie. It's, it's almost like doing the girl in the spider's is. web after you did the uh, girl with a dragon tattoo. What else can you do with it? Yeah, what if? <laughs> <laughs> it's like, I mean, that's the problem. They're, they're redoing the Hell- origin. And, uh, you watch yeah. Hellboy now, it's, it's, it doesn't hold up as well as it did a few years back. The second one does. And I like the second one, not the first one. Over The first one I did not like at all. Right. I'm mostly talking about the first yeah. one. Yeah. Um, well, the the one Golden Army, is yeah. it called? The yeah. Second yeah. Golden Army. It's Golden Army. Um, a lot better, but... Um, you know, it, those movies are what they are. Really, you can't you can't really add that much to it. So the fact that you're even making a third one, yeah, that's shocking. Or a shocking. reboot, and whatever, it's a remake. Remake. whatever this is called. Yeah, whatever. Reboot. Yeah. 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 What is the difference, really? A it's reboot like, or a reboot? I, I mean, if they make reboot. I'm mean, doing Suicide Squad. <laughs> Speaking of which, I feel Jim. like a re. Oh, yeah, boy. Jesus. See what I did there? Yeah, I know. Ladies and gentlemen, this, <laughs> this, is, this is a segue. That's called a that's called a reboot segue. A remake segue. <laughs> Jared Leto hinted to reappear as the Joker in Birds of Prey uh, in recent uh, marketing, I guess. Can you he's, dig that? Don't on fucking that, care. <laughs> Nobody likes that guy. Anymore. Says Matt. <laughs> Oscar winner Jared Leto, who's also playing Morbius for some reason uh hinted to repeat. yeah that's happening that's happening <laughs> that's folks. a thing for some that's, reason that's definitely that's happening a vampire. Now. <laughs> you know what i want to make i want to make the molten vampire. man movie you know the molten man spider-man's 18th uh strongest villain i want to make a movie about that guy <laughs> I think more of get, well, get, get, get ready you're you are going to see everything now oh, gee. i mean everything coming at you. look what venom did look gonna... what venom did look, look what you fucking yeah. damn fools did get ready Get ready. You thought Old Country Buffet was just for food. Just wait until you see your movies come flying out of your ass. Oh, God, I'm Brittany Murphy in Sin City. You fools. 
You damn fool. I'm Brittany Murphy in real life. <laughs> <laughs> He's dead. Uh, Brittany Murphy dead. Uh, <laughs> Door of the Explorer trailer. <laughs> Can you take it? Oh, yeah? Was that the oh, porno yeah. one I No, wanted? no, no. That's Dora the Butt Explorer. That's a different movie. Oh, yes. Nah. That's my favorite one. <laughs> nah, I didn't see that. Uh, yeah, yeah, Ma- Michael Pena and uh, what's the name of the girl from Desperate Housewives who's not Felicity Huffman's uh, getting her daughter into college? Terry Hatcher? No, the other one. Eva uh, Longoria? Eva Longoria. She's the Dora the Explorer's mom. There you go. Oh, I thought oh, she was hey. playing Dora. The <laughs> Who's playing Dora the Explorer? The girl from the last Transformers movie, and she was in the Instant Family with Mark Wahlberg. Uh, I forget her name. Oh, yeah, was that, it me? Oh, yeah, she's or really did, good. Or is it Funny or Die made a better one? Yeah, I remember the Funny or Die one. Yeah, that should yeah, be I the movie. That. Yeah. They should have made College it unserious, thing. and I would have probably more been more. But this looks like it's like if yeah. Tomb Raider and. Uh, oh yeah, that went over well. <laughs> if Tomb Raider. And uh, Cheetah Raider Girls made a movie. And... It'd be Dora the Explorer. <laughs> All right. Can't wait. Yeah. Honestly, it looks, looks like it should be on Disney see Family. The it look Doug bad. Funny movie, please. I would love yeah, a absolutely. Doug Funny movie. Oh, gotta be all hey, in that uh, Doug Funny movie. Hey, did hey, I tell funny. you I can sing? I can sing the theme song to Doug Yeah, go, go ahead. Oh, sing yeah, let's one sing more time. it together. Banging one more time. I haven't sung it yet. <laughs> Banging. Oh, we're doing off camp. We're doing off air. Sorry. Go ahead. Do do do. Drumming on the street. Like. All right, ne- uh, next one. Uh, Jai-, Jai Courtney's back as Boomerang in Suicide Squad movie. Can you <laughs> as I move past this? That's Captain Boomerang, but just Boomerang? Just Boomerang, whatever you want. Fuck is, Captain. Is he, he going to be in the reboot of the Eddie Murphy movie as Boomerang? Oh, Jesus. Oi. If he was oi. in. <laughs> oi, I'm going to get you. Oi. oi, are you Robin Givens? <laughs> He was oi, in that he's movie, the seven right? up guy in the fucking boomerang movie. Boomerang was an Eddie Murphy <laughs> movie in the eighties, kids. I think the nineties. Chris 90s? Rock was in there, right? Chris Rock, Martin Lawrence, was, David Allen Greer, oh, yeah, Grace Jones, Halle Berry. Yeah, yeah, Robin Gibbons. Man. Everybody was in that Ooh, movie. I, I like film. Boomerang. Boomerang's a great movie. It was prime prime Robin, huh? Mm-hmm. That was prime Robin. That was she was given everything. She's given it all. She was given it. She was given it all. Uh, anyway, uh, Jack Gordon is back as Captain Boomerang. Can you think? Never mind. What? Oh, Jack Gordon. I mean, yeah. I guess he was born to play that role. He's the only role he's the only role he's I've ever liked in Captain Boomerang. Yeah, me too. Good for him. Yeah, good for him. Good for Jack Courtney, man. Bad for us. Good for him. He was in he was in Alita Battle Angel for that amount of time. That's oh, cool. And his head was. Only no, I everybody in that movie. Cillian Murphy, or Killian Murphy, whatever, however you pronounce this fucking guy's name, is going to be in Quiet Place 2. Killian. Killian Casey. Killian. Killian Murphy. He's going to be in Quiet Place Killian 2. Murphy. Can you dig that? Killmonger? Killian. <laughs> Killmonger 2? Kill- Aldrich Killian from uh, Iron Man 3. No, Killian Murphy. Uh, they're doing another Did you hear they quiet recast place? the Black Panther as a white guy? No, no, never oh. mind. All right, uh, <laughs> moving on. Uh, Pennyworth series. <laughs> Can you dig that? <laughs> the what series? Alfred Pennyworth series. Uh, you know, oh, is it? Oh. as a child, when I watched Batman, mm. I always thought, wouldn't it be great hey, if I could just watch... Watch the butler, butler. <laughs> watch the movie the about butler. the butler. <laughs> <laughs> it's like I saw the butler. He was in my six. He was a master white. When I was in MI6. <laughs> but when when I had a tangerine, it was the size of a rope. <laughs> it was a rope. The size of a tangerine. I gave, I gave it to a kid, and the kid took it <laughs> because and threw it, it was, because, because it was good sport. Because <laughs> it was a good sport. It was good. It was good sport. A good it was sport. Good sport. Do you think? Do you because think they sat down with DC Comics and said, <laughs> What can we oh, make a show out of We're looking for a butler. Okay? Remember that story that Alfred tells in The Dark Knight? Some men just want to watch the world burn, Master White. They go, You okay, know what? Let's make a show about that. Let's turn that into a series. Like, can you make us a spec script for that story right now? <laughs> it's a series, right? Certainly so. We were in Burma and we were looking for rubies. Burma. <laughs> Is it a series on TV or is it a series on like CBS I think it's on like Amazon or some Hulu or some shit. It's not going to be like on Fox and it's like Fox, no. Gotham's After ending, Gotham goes off the that. air. We're, we're picking up right so, away. So Gotham's finally, Gotham's finally going to have Batman show up, huh? Gives a fuck. Uh, next one. Uh, <laughs> no, we won't. Master, Master we won't White. Nobody's going to watch White. it. Uh, Spielberg the Hypocrite. Uh, can you dig that? Is yeah, well, I figured that. I mean, he is, after all, a... Yeah. <clears throat> okay. I know, yes. you're go- I know where you're going with this. Oh, yes. okay. That, I thought it was something different. No, I, th- no. I thought it was another three-letter word. What, what possibly could you think I would have said? I don't know. Huh. I, th- I think it uh, it rhymed with poo. Okay, next one. Oh. Uh, <laughs> Lou? You thought, you thought it was Lou? Yeah, it's funny, isn't it? He, <laughs> you know, it's funny when his what a real Lou. are being lined with money. 
well. he uh, changes his, uh, yeah, his tune, his... huh? <laughs> yeah, well, sometimes tune when screen, you're man. friends with Oprah, <laughs> and uh, who else? In color, he did director in color purple. I mean, they they got a connection there. Yeah. Uh, I like the that. I like. Oh, the Witherspoon girl too. Yeah, Witherspoon Reese was Witherspoon? there, and uh, oh, well, Witherspooning. And, uh, Witherspoon's Aaron, friends with Oprah uh, because of the the Aaron the, 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 the Aaron Ava Brockovich DuVernay or, movie. Yeah. Uh, yeah. The, Ricklin time. Brockovich was there. Oh, Aaron, Julia, Julie, Bro- Julie. Brockmeyer. Brockmeyer was there. Oh, Aaron. Aaron look at my tits, Brockovich. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right, next one. Uh, Thunder Force, uh, Netflix superhero movie starring Octavia Spencer and Melissa McCarthy. Can you dig that? Thun- Thunder Force. <laughs> Thunder Force. Thunder Force Five. What are you talking? About? I want to repeat what I just said because it's real. Thunder Melissa Force, McCarthy, a Netflix heard, superhero movie Octavia starring Spencer. Octavia Spencer and Melissa McCarthy. Can you dig that? Are they the superheroes? Yes. Oh, wow. huh. cool. Well, it's got Melissa McCarthy in it, or whatever, McCartney, whatever. We, I'd never get that right. It's got Paul McCartney in it. Paul, Mc- Paul, Paul McCartney. McCartney. It's got, hello. So I Paul. suppose it's, it's going to be thing. like fart and shit jokes. And <laughs> oh, yeah. Is that where the thunder yeah, comes yeah, in? Cool. Fall, and falling, falling down a lot. And I, you know, I, Spencer, I got a thing with Spencer. Octavia Spencer, oh. you, got a good, oh, you got a thing? What are you going to do? No, I, I just Spencer don't Tracy? I just, I don't know. Just don't care for it. You're not, you're not into that mama, she, that mama that movie that's coming that out. That mom movie looks okay. That, looks that cool. mom movie looks pretty good though. That's yeah. my yeah. predicament, guys. It's like you geez, don't yeah, like her, but you like her. You kind of like on the fence, kind of like she does some good things, yeah, some bad know. things. Yeah. Now she's like, with Melissa. Anything uh, can go, I guess. I, well, I, I feel like everybody likes Melissa McCartney now because she did that movie. Wait, it's called uh, Thunder Force. It's called Thunder, Thunder Force, Force, starring Melissa McCarthy and Octavia Spencer. I repeat for the third time. Not so th- they, are they, not are they gonna farce? fart so loud? Okay, that it's gonna cause thunder. <laughs> okay that's the. I, I see. I, I see. A, I see a thing now where. Oh, Thunder Thigh. Thunder Thigh. <laughs> that's what you said. No, that's not what I said at all. <laughs> not what I said at all. Is there a scene where they're flying and they fly into a brick wall and they fall down and go? <laughs> Only in your dreams. Oh, I can't wait. I can't wait to go to bed. Can you dig it? Can you dig it? Can you dig it? <laughs> Let's do some TV roundup. <laughs> Thunder. Can't wait to go to Thunder bed. Thunder pants? <laughs> Thunder lips? He's gonna jump, Matt's gonna jump into the bed. Woo! Can't wait for this dream. Oh, man, can't wait to can't wait for this dream. Oh man, women. F- Big, big, big walls. Big, ooh, you imagine big, the big you imagine the women. climax of Fearless with <laughs> Rosie Perez and Jeff Bridges. In yeah. <laughs> Justin, what have you been watching for TV in the market? <laughs> so I watched a new show. Yes. What? What show is it? Happy. Oh, did you start watching Happy? Happy? I've never watched. It. I hear it's good. It got Pat Oswalt. I started it. watching Happy. Can you explain What's to me what that show, show is about? about? Explain to me what Happy is about. Whoa. Um. Hmm. <laughs> Huh. Good question, DJ. Um, <laughs> I saw a trailer. And I was confused. What's going on? <laughs> Apparently, I mean, listen, I haven't finished the first season yet. Mm-hmm. I'm still like. I think it's based on a like comic book, too. Seven or a graphic novel? It's a comic book. Apparently, it's a. Yeah. There are certain issues I don't like with the um, directing. Mm. Uh, but other than that, cast is pretty great. Maloney's um, good. Maloney's, a, yeah, he, he. Oh, is this a show with the with the purple or the blue thing? He yes. sees only he sees. Okay. Who is played, it. voiced by Pat Oswalt. Pat Oswalt. Mm-hmm. Oh, okay. And it's dark. It is very dark. Um, it starts off um, with a little girl getting um, kidnapped by a Santa Claus. <laughs> and what? Um, that's pretty creepy. Yeah, yeah, that's the worst thing and I've ever heard in my life. <laughs> yes, but um, Pat Oswalt is this um, this like purple unicorn that um, only certain people can see. It's it's he's the imagination of the young girl. Oh, and so when she gets kidnapped, the imagination goes to go get help. What? Uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah. And at the same time, uh, my God, I can't even think of his name, the character's name. But Maloney, yeah, he is a cop, a super cop. They call they he's rate Jackie Chan in the newspaper. Super, he's Jackie super Chan. Cop. <laughs> he's the Hell cop yeah. that can't like be stopped. Drunk. Is that what's going on here? <laughs> well, I think he can be. He gets shot and then he like falls down and and comes back to life. And oh. the you know the EMTs bring him back to life. But he drinks. He's you know he's oh. just a shithead and he just smells like shit and gets beat <laughs> up. Smells and like shit. Uh, almost gets his dick cut off at what? one point. What, what is this show? And I like. He's this. going after good. the mob. 
and he kills um, the only person that knows this code. And now everybody's after the mom's after him because the guy told them the code and he killed them all. So oh. there's a lot going on. Um, that's only like the first five episodes, by the way. Oh, wow! Uh, but it's it's entertaining. It's on Netflix. It's in it's season two. Show. Isn't it? Se- is it in season, season two? two. Yeah, yeah, there's two seasons it. apparently. I'm but a- uh, it gets dark. I mean, there's cocaine use. There's, there's killing. There's some great fight scenes. There's some great action. Fun for the whole great family. Heads getting blown off. A good Ooh. good amount of blood. Oof. And then uh, you got a you got a, an imagination that talks to you, and it's 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 kind of crazy. It's interesting. And, so is uh, it is it the, is the so whole far. show him trying to find the girl the whole series or he finds her? <clears throat> no, oh, you don't. You, um, you don't want to spoil it. So far, well, well so, uh, so far, um, so not everyone can see the imagination, mm-hmm. but he can, and um, he's not wanting to find the little girl. He doesn't believe there's a little girl uh, missing. There is. Huh. Um, so like the first few episodes, he's trying. Oops, sorry. <laughs> Justin just head by the computer. Okay. I just head by the computer. I just hit the microphone. Um, he's he's trying to uh, uh, get Maloney to um, to come. So it's it's he's he's doing his own thing, and then the imagination comes and is like, "Hey, we gotta save this little girl." And he's like, "Get the fuck away from me!" And um, that's pretty much where we're at right now. Huh. But there is some good amount of. Uh, action and violence that I'm, I've really surprised me. I wasn't sure what I was getting into. I didn't read the synopsis. I saw a trailer or two. So the other night I turned it on and, and pressed play and after the first episode I was kind of upset about certain, like I said, uh, direction. There's some visual elements I didn't really care for. It kind of felt a little cheap. But uh, when it gets dark, it gets dark and you know me. I'm a fucked up individual. So... Um, <laughs> I really enjoyed that uh, aspect of it, and uh, certain uh, certain actors, character actors that um, uh, name I don't really know, but you know when you see them, and they pop up. A few of them pop up, and um, it's pretty good, pretty good stuff. Uh, yeah, I saw a trailer for, uh, sorry, a blooper reel, and it, one of the scenes, the Big Show was on there. I was like, what the hell is the Big Show doing on this show? But yeah, I, I, I wanted to see it when it first came out, but for some reason I got sidetracked. I think I was because it was a sci-fi show, and I was like, uh, sci-fi. Yeah, <laughs> I know. When I saw that, I was like, sci-fi? This is Netflix. What? I thought it was a Netflix show. They probably and, bought the rights uh, for now, and then they get rid of it in the world. Yeah, it's just all in there. But it takes place during Christmas, which, you know, we love. Yes. That adds to the effect. Mm-hmm. Um, I don't like Christmas. Uh, I know. You Jews don't. Like <laughs> you did. Yep. Jeez. All right. Yep. Matthew, you already thought of something too, that you've seen. Oh, yeah. I saw, uh, you know me. I don't really finish things. No. <laughs> you get that right. <laughs> you just usually pay somebody off. Yeah. I yeah, I usually pay somebody off. <laughs> or I, pay, I pay beforehand, and they, I still don't finish it off, but mm-hmm. it's fine. What a waste. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I know. Uh, what's some of the stuff? Um, I've been watching a lot of that... Uh, you know the CNN shows that did like the 70s, the 60s, 70s, yeah, 80s, the old 90s, docu 2000s? series, or whatever. Oh, yeah, that shit is fucking fantastic. I love you're, like you're, that. you're big into documentaries now. You're a big doc head. Oh, like yeah. That. You're a doc head. I'm a doc head. I'm, I mean, people call me dickhead, but I'm going for the doc head. <laughs> I days. thought they were saying doc, doc head, head uh, but apparently it was dickhead. Yeah. And <laughs> yeah so, but uh, no, they, no, they I, I, the, uh, a couple the of them, are, when they're done well, they're like really, really good. Oh yeah. Well, the 2000s just got released this month, and blazed through that. Those eight episodes, you know, and uh, of course you have the, you know, talking about Bush and you know his ineptitude and all the other uh, fucking garbage. He looks like a fucking. He looks like a past. prince right now. He was George Bush is oh, just fucking yeah, dancing yeah. around like, hey man. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's like, like, it's like you fool me once, man. You fool me three times. <laughs> Bet so, you re let me now, wouldn't you? Wouldn't you? <laughs> yeah, mother- yeah, motherfucker. <laughs> It's like you, you had me, you had a black man, and now have an orange man. <laughs> what are you gonna do? Syracuse. You know, I bet you want a vanilla man now, huh? <laughs> he's like a, he's like a tangerine. Tangerine. Like a tan- Look at him. Oh, I just want to squeeze his head. There's a tangerine man. There's a tangerine. The size of a Trump. A Trump. Man. The size Mr. White. of a tangerine. And we can say Trump on the show because Trump literally means fart. 
So it's we're true. not talking about There's a man the size of a fart. That, we're talking about that Trump. That's the Trump we're talking about. Yes. We're not talking yeah, we're about we're any getting other Trump into politics. Here. Gotta hate yeah, what I hate. I hate Trumps. I hate. I hate sometimes when you're around I a bunch Trump. of people and you're Trump. Well, they stink. It's so embarrassing. It's so embarrassing. Yeah, it's embarrassing. Stink. Trump. You get around. Is everybody's talking, and then it's, Trump happens. God, it's like sometimes and, you Trump, and then a little shit comes out. It's it's the worst. It's the worst. Oh, it's. it's I mean, when I think of Trump, I think of uh, toilets. Oh, of course. Yeah. Of course. Wait, what else would you think of? Uh, I mean, underwear. I feel like you need one near you uh, in case you Trump too hard. Uh, I mean, it, no. then sometimes you with a pretty girl and you like she's really hot and you're like oh wow and then she trumps you're like oh no I can't oh, I can't do anything yeah, like I, can't that. Do it I gotta move on yeah. it's terrible usually it hey you know what's worse when you trump and um you get the the dingleberry oh god oh, oh god but, well, don't, don't they call that one don't later, they call though. that uh, Ivanka they call it Ivanka right that's an Ivanka Trump I right? believe that's what they call oh, it right, right, yeah I'm not yeah. Yeah, I mean, nothing, I'm still nothing, learning English. No, nothing worse than Trump and then having an Ivanka for oh, later. God, the worst man. thing is Oof, Jesus. You know, <laughs> what's the worst? Uh, or yeah. or when you when yeah. you laugh so hard, you trump yourself. Oh man, uh, it happens all the time. Yeah, it's liquidy. That is, uh, that is the worst. But hard at the same time. Sometimes I huckabee, yeah. and it's yeah. it's really it gets in my throat a little bit. Uh, it's a huckabee. Uh, it's, it's really it's, yeah. It's, it's sometimes I huckabee at least twice a day. Usually I'm watching Labyrinth, so I'm Do like you? Sarah huckabee, and That's it's like, cool. oh Jesus Christ, I got it stuck in my throat. Mm-hmm. I don't know what. what it's weird. It's weird. I hate it. Um, you should get that looked at. I'm going yeah. to yeah. go to ear, nose, and throat doctor. I'm going to get that all cleared out. Yeah. That's <laughs> probably that's probably best it's, for it's, you. It's, it's not good. Oh, that's um, probably something you need yeah. to get on. And but, the, uh, it, it, you it, know. It, work on it. And then, you, you know, the worst is. What? Far mm-hmm. worse. What's worse what? than that? Is when you get the little junior Trumps. Oh, jeez. Oh, the baby yeah. Trump is worse because it's not even like. Baby. It's like silent but deadly, those little baby Trumps. Like, they kill so giraffes. Like like Trump. I've seen a baby so Trump kill a them. giraffe. I've seen it. I've seen pictures of it. Kill a giraffe in mm-hmm. Africa. It's, it's, it's awful. Awful. Oh, it's because it's so terrible. Oh, remember, God. remember that old black and white video of the uh, elephant getting electrocuted to death? Yes. Oh, uh, was that Trump? That was a Trump, right? Yeah. That was a Trump that, that did that it. That was right? a bad Trump. Uh, that Trump was a bad. Did. That was a bad junior. That was a bad junior, actually. You know, come to think of it, nine eleven was Trump oh, too, wasn't yeah, it? Yeah, I think so. He was in New York. Trump. I, there was Trumps all over New York. Trumps is a big there Trump. Was, that's a there giant was. Trump building in Trump New York. It was, it was the size of a building. Yeah. Was it? And a was Trump it a Trump Trump there and a Trump Trump the there? Was there a Chipotle at the tower? I'm pretty sure it was a Moe's, but I'm, I'm, I'm not going to throw stones. I don't know what causes oh, a Trump. Oh, welcome to Moe's. It could have been, been a Taco Del Could have been a Taco Del Taco. Could have been a Taco Bell. Oh, no, 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 no. It was a Taco Bell. Oh, oh, oh yeah, of course yeah. it was. Cross the border. Bell. See, the border Every, thing. If, you, I yeah, hear if you're Trump enough, you want to build a wall around the Taco Bell because, you know, we want to yeah, make do. sure that border is secure. You don't want to have anything coming near Sometimes, you that's yeah. not, you know... Not American. You want to make sure that Trump stays in in home. In home Trump. Well, sometimes I Trump so hard, I need to build a wall around my asshole. Oh, jeez. Well, you know what I read mm. in the journal, the mm. medical journal yes. recently? Oh. That if you analyze each Trump, or as they say, Trumplet. Trumplet, yeah, um, of course, of course yes. Yeah, y- you will notice that they all come from everywhere in the world. Actually, there's no... Um, protein in the Trumps that <laughs> specifies that they actually came from the states. Uh, uh, it's you know, there's a Mexican in there, there's yeah, European, yeah. A little bit um, of African, a little bit of everything. Yeah. A potpourri of Trumps. It's, it's, it's yeah. a potpourri. <laughs> well, you need potpourri when you're. Oh, definitely Trump, need. Yeah. <laughs> I feel. I feel like we're gonna have to audit this Trump. Yeah. <laughs> uh, well, I think we will be okay. I mean, <laughs> we're only talking about. We're talking about Trump. farting. It's essentially what it is. Yeah, we're just talking about shitting our pants while farting. <laughs> oh, yeah. I thought that was yeah, obvious. I though. mean, what else I mean, are we... What, if the, who if the audience gets about confused. About something else? It's a, clearly, it's a Trump. It's a clearly a Trump. Yeah, clearly. Yeah, a lot of, lot of, lot of corn in those oh, Trumps. God, oh, man, the corn. It's, I don't know where it's coming from. I don't even eat corn. It's there. I don't understand. No. <laughs> it's like eating a bag of Fritos and not feeling good about it. And look at it. It's just so ugly. Some yeah, guys like a, like, like a weird over. Sometimes hairy. It's, and and, and, yeah. and the hair is not really like yeah. real hair. It's like slapped to the side a little bit. Like it's yeah. well, it's not supposed to have hair on it. Of course, yeah. clearly the it's hair. weird. It's, it's like artificial. how it's un- yeah, so, teeth so falls so undigested. It's weird. it's weird. I don't. Okay. Um. I w- and it, and it does and 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 the Trump is so unsuccessful. Oh God. But then it pretends it pretends that it is successful. So it's like it's unsuccessful, but it keeps saying it is successful. So it's like weird. It can't even flush. Jesus. Yeah. It feels hardy. It feels hardy at the look of it, but when you really touch it, it it's empty. It's it empty just falls inside. apart. It's like it just blackness. falls apart. It's hollow. <laughs> it's hollow. I don't know. Sometimes I just go out back and look at my septic and just think, oh, look at all this Trump. Look at all this it's Trump just, in here. This is it's where it filled with, yeah. Yo, this my is whole backyard is filled with Trump. It's filled with Trump. Yep. I don't get it. I don't get it. 
I, mean, I don't know. Maybe yeah. we should just light it on fire. Oh, no, maybe. no. And then they, 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 they so did that in Charleston. The, it was a the big the deal. Stench, was, the stench is, the stench is oh, pretty. Is that what they did? Yeah, it was a big deal, man. You can't. You well, because the only way, you know, because when you spray after a Trump. Oh, God. Um, does, it doesn't. Does it even it work? just mask it. It doesn't kill the spray. You know, it doesn't no. kill the scent. Yeah. No. And the only way, really, is to light a match. It just fights against it. Yeah. Unless you, no, unless you get it, that Russian spray. That Russian spray, it will hide. the. Where are you going to get that at? Amazon? You can go to Moscow. Uh, you know, you can go to you know Georgia. Well, my favorite, my my, my absolute favorite scent is the Putin scent. Oh, the Putin scent is the great. Putin. The Putin scent. Yeah. Oh, it's so good. Nothing, I have to smell that. Nothing, stop, like nothing a, stops a Trump like a Putin. Kind of smells like a Tell bear, me. like a man riding a bear. It's just, like a man bear. Okay. Yeah, like okay. a man riding a horse. <laughs> well, that makes sense. <laughs> like a horse blanket. It needs something very strong, like a horse or a bear, um, to mask that smell or possibly kill it. Yeah. <laughs> This is Miscast Entertainment with your hosts, William Davis Moore, Greg, and JJ. Every week, these misfits will make it their mission to bring you irreverent entertainment reviews, entertainment news, gaming videos, film-inspired food and drinks, fun facts, and more. Now, get your ass over to YouTube so you can absorb this shite into your brain meat through your eyeballs. We are Miscast Entertainment, and we are here to amuse you. If the listeners of this next segment had any famous last words, it'd most certainly be, why? It's Simplistic Last Lines. This is Simplistic Last Lines. This is where I will read the last line to some famous films, and Matt and Justin will have to buzz in and guess which film that line is from. First to four correct guesses wins. I will read the lines deadpan, but each of you have a lifeline in which I will read the line as close to the way it is delivered in the film as possible, which may help or may not. Matt's buzzer will be the sound of the first few notes of the Tales of the Crypt theme. And Justin's buzzer will be the first few notes of the Danny Elfman's Batman theme. Gentlemen, are you ready? Man, we haven't, we haven't played this game in, in, in a long time. In a long time. A very long time. We haven't time. played this game in a Trump. I'm ready, Jim. Are we ready, Jim? Jim. All right, here we go. I'm going to read a deadpan. And then, uh, yep. remember, one lifeline each. I remember something may hurt, hurt you or help you. Just, here we go. A world full of superheroes. Huh. As a great man once said, way to get a load of me. Justin? <laughs> I know that movie. Yes. You do? Did you know that movie? Do Did I know, know that movie? movie? I'm looking at the answer, so yes, I do know that. <laughs> Well, I know it's not the sequel. Oh, what is it then? Ooh. I know it's the first one. Uh-huh. Huh. Do you know what it? Matthew, he's asking you. Of course he knows what it is. Do I, I know what it is? is? I don't fucking know. It's called. Ready? Yes. Kick-Ass. Yes, it's Kick-Ass. Correct. That's a... Oh, yeah. And I wasn't cause... buying time because I couldn't think of the <laughs> it was, he, he wasn't enough. at all typing this into a computer <laughs> and looking at an oh, answer yes, yes. for like, it. All right. <laughs> There he goes. Okay. Where did they get a load of uh, me? Of me. <laughs> it could have been Batman. That's why I was. Uh, it's, it's a tricky one. It's a tricky line. There. I know you were being tricky. Tricky. Very with tricky. That one. Could have been Batman '89. That's what the trick was. Right. So, so what would what would have been the, the lifeline where you would have been talking like? <laughs> it, this one mouth. would have probably not helped you because yeah. I'd just be. Yeah. 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 I'd just be mealy mouth. Sorry, yeah. trying to sound like Christopher yeah, Mintz Plus. Yeah, which be is, McLovin it. Yeah, McLovin the hell out of it. All right, here we go. Number two. Mm. It's one yeah. nothing, Justin. Here we go. We can do whatever we want. This might be a hard one because I'm not sure if either of you have seen this film, but it's a big movie. We, we, can, we, we can, can do whatever, do whatever we, we, want. we want. Yes. Now you got a lifeline. Just putting it out there. Huh. I like the. Uh, I like that. That's pretty good. It's mm-hmm. a good one. Yeah. Mm-hmm. We can do whatever we want. Yes. It sounds like um, like one of those posters that you would see at work. <laughs> Try to get you going. With like Kathy or something. It's like a cat like hanging that. from a tree. Hang in there. Yeah, it's like hang in there. <laughs> we can do whatever we want. Okay, now remember you have a want. lifeline. It's a one nothing Matthew. Uh, one nothing Justin. No, it's one. It's one nothing. Give 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 the pies on his day in court. Yes, it is his day in court. The line is: We can do whatever we want. Last line of the movie. We can. The last line of the movie. Last line of the movie. That's the name of the game. Last line. Was this in a trailer? Uh, it might be in the trailer, but it's also the last line of the movie. Uh, hmm. I don't know. Again, you get a lifeline if you want. I, th- 
If you want to buzz Thought in, of a newer movie. Could be a you newer movie. Could be an older movie. Want. Could be a movie. Could be a, a film. So, so you're thinking this is a movie that we haven't seen? We might have. I'm not sure if you've seen it. I'm just, you know, I know it's uh, a lot of people have seen it. So, oh, well, that means we haven't seen it. <laughs> <Yep>. <laughs> we don't obviously watch other popular film. Yes. Again, the line is: we can do whatever we want. I'm reading a deadpan, not the way it's said in the movie. Here's a big clue. I'll, I'll use my lifeline now. Why don't you give me the, the good read huh. behind it? Okay, here we go. You ready? We can do whatever we want. We can do, we can do whatever we want. Re- repeat that again. <laughs> okay, okay, here we go. <laughs> we can do whatever we want. We can do whatever we want. Yes. We can do whatever we want. Yes. No. It's probably gonna kick. You're gonna kick yourself once you uh, figure out. Oh, probably. I do it. I do it on daily <laughs> basis. On a daily basis. <laughs> Fucking know what this shit is. Me watching popular movies. <laughs> mm. Uh, no, I don't. I don't know. Whatever. I'm glad I wasted that lifeline. Mm. Justin, would you like to? Guess or would we? Uh, let me give you guys an answer. I don't think I can. Okay. No. The answer is sorry. 2018's Venom. <laughs> oh, okay. Uh, well, uh, 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 well. So that hmm. was the la- that was the last line of the movie. Yeah, that is the last line of the movie. <laughs> oh wow! I I, I, well, want. I didn't see the beginning, middle, or end. <laughs> That's why I had to do. Not the, because the, I the not shitty because Venom I don't want to see it. Yeah, so this doesn't make sense. They can't swim, right? No. <laughs> They're walking. Tom Hardy's walking down the street talking to Venom, and Venom. He, Tom Hardy goes, "What do we do next?" In his weird Philadelphia fucking accent, and then uh, uh, Venom goes, "We can do whatever we want," and that's how it cuts the cuts the black. These 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 will not have after credit sequences. I'm not counting the after credit sequence of Venom, which is Woody Harrelson going, "If we ever get out of here, it's gonna be carnage," which is fucking stupid as shit. I ain't doing that. <laughs> Oh, come on. It's, it's fucking clever. dumb as hell. Anyway. Uh, hey, that's the name why? of his character. Yeah. Why, do you hate, hey. why, why do you hate movies that are universally loved, DJ? I hate Venom and I hate Carnage. I've hated him since comic book form, so I don't blame the movie. I just blame the characters. Okay. Uh, so it's one nothing. <laughs> <laughs> I thought that was going to be an easy one. All right, here we go. Till next time, this is your friendly neighborhood pool guy singing, I'm never going to dance again. Oh, my God. I don't know any of these. Till we neighborhood friendly pool guy? Yes. Uh, Till next time, uh, this is your friendly neighborhood pool guy singing, I'm never gonna dance again. Oh my god. The last line of the movie. Again, I'm not counting. Another after last credits. line of a movie? That's the whole point of this game. <laughs> That's the whole oh, point. I, I wasn't paying attention. All of these lines are the last line of the movie. <laughs> oh, see, now I'm. Okay, now, now I get it. Uh-huh. Now I get the game, finally. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> that was simplistic first line. No, no. Whose line is it? Whose line is it anyway? <laughs> anyway. A, Till next uh, time, this is your family neighborhood pool guy singing I'm Never Gonna Dance Again. Again, a very popular film, and I'm not counting the after credit sequence. A very, It's a very popular film? <laughs> yeah, it's a very popular film. <laughs> very popular. I, I, I guess I never stick around to the end of the no. film. No, <laughs> you just leave before the movie ends. <laughs> I leave before this. Like this movie sucks. <laughs> I hate this movie. I don't know. Do you know Justin? I'm really thinking here. <laughs> <laughs> I am again. Maybe you guys have not my, seen this movie, but this is a pretty big movie. <laughs> again, a pretty big. You might want to listen to what I'm telling you. I'll read the line again. Till the next time. This is your friendly neighborhood pool guy singing. I'm never gonna dance again. And again, I'm reading it deadpan. I'm not reading it the way he said it. Yeah. I'm trying to think of, like, who's a pool guy in a movie. Mm-hmm. It's like a pool, like a, like a swimming pool. Uh, you want to buzz in and go, want to guess? Because I can't give no, you a clue No, I don't. <laughs> Can I get a clue? Uh, no. No clues. Unless you want to use your lifeline to buzz in. <laughs> Okay. Yes. What's my What's my clue? So you're gonna get no, it. I'm not giving you a clue. I can I can you can use a lifeline. I can read it the way it's said in the movie. That's about as clue as I can give you. Oh, man. <laughs> yeah, give it to me. <clears throat> See, I don't know what the name. Let me use game my is. Life simplistic last line. Again, these, these lifelines can hurt you or help you. Here we go. 
Oh, this is probably not going to help you. <laughs> Till the next time, this is your friendly neighborhood pool guy singing, I'm never going to dance again. <laughs> I feel like you read it the same way you so, read so it originally. Not really any change. That's exactly how he says it. <laughs> and it's a he. There you go. <laughs> he does say guy in, in the, the dialogue. Okay, so. there you go. Yeah, I'm about to say, I mean, but, man, it could be gender fluid. You know. The you know, answer like, is in the, 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 here's your clue. The answer is in the uh, statement there. Ah, uh, I got it. I don't. I don't think it's the second one. I think it's Deadpool. Correct. <laughs> okay. 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 I thought it was the second one first. No, second. That's, that's the first one. Kind of just driving me. <laughs> he, he says, says "Till the yeah. next time, it's your friendly neighborhood wow. pool guy, Deadpool." Yeah. Oh, yeah, like a yeah. pool, <laughs> like a dead singing. Pool. I'm never gonna oh, dance yeah. again. Okay. <laughs> Justin's uh, up to nothing. Okay. Here we go. Okay. Well. Yes. Yeah, he's doing well. He's mm -hmm. really good at this okay. game. Uh, <laughs> yeah. If only I didn't get the other one. <laughs> I know you. You would be. Right, yeah, here's a, here's one. a tricky already. one. Are you ready? Are you ready? You would have been. You would have been by game oh, game set match. The problem is I didn't see that fucking movie. <laughs> you never saw Deadpool. Wow, it made seven hundred no, no. million dollars. Venom. Oh, Venom. Oh, Venom. Yeah, yeah. Sorry. Uh, don't worry. <laughs> that made eight hundred million dollars. Uh, I own Deadpool. Jesus. <laughs> Okay, here's a, here's one that's here's he one that's very him. tricky. Okay, here we go. You ready? Oh, can't wait. I prefer Magneto. I prefer Ooh, Magneto. tricky, huh? Because mm -hmm. you think tricky, you know tricky, what it tricky. is, but it might be a spoof. Or there's this, 19 oh, of these films. Yeah. <laughs> you got to figure out which know, ones. <laughs> hmm. The process of I elimination. I prefer Magneto. Hmm. I'm gonna take a guess because I don't lose any points, right? No. <laughs> it's a guess. No. <laughs> scary, scary. <laughs> Nobody's was coming for you. I'm not the tax man. <laughs> was it, Give me a money. He's the tax man. <laughs> uh, X to X Men United. Incorrect. <laughs> <laughs> that was a shot. Now give me all your points. <laughs> I don't think it was the first one. <laughs> give me all. Matthew, would you trick. like to harness the guess? Seeing that uh, a, there's only flim flam four, my points four, I gave the mat. four more guesses. <laughs> Thanks. A little bait, a little bait switch. switch uh, I prefer Mag. I prefer Mag. <laughs> you went the comic book guy, Rod. Uh, I like that. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Magneto. Um, Fuck. Okay, I guess I will. Well, since Justin is already uh, busting, I, here's a clue. Me and Justin saw this movie together. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> I think. No, I feel like you guys seen a no, lot of movies. Not, not all the X Men movies. <laughs> not all the X Men movies. Uh, okay. okay. Well, now I, mean, I know I which say, one. Uh, well, I'll give Matt a clue. Get, if, if, if if it's one that you guys saw together, I'm imagining that it's X Men: The Last Stand. Mm. No, incorrect. It is X Men First Class. <laughs> oh, okay. Huh. Oh, First Class. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah right. First Class all the way. Okay, here we go. Next one. <laughs> I don't know. I thought. Did you guys see The Last Stand together? No, <laughs> no, 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 no. I never watched that movie. <laughs> I saw. I think I saw it on HBO. Like, <laughs> really? You didn't go to the theater? Never saw it in the theater. No, 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 no. Really? Oh. Yeah, I saw it in the theater. Oh. I was like, woof, 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 woof. All right, Buzz here, your girlfriend. Here, here, here goes one. Uh, maybe Justin will get this. Maybe Matt will get this. This is, this is kind of both in your wheelhouses. You, There's a 50-50 shot. What both of you guys it. really like this movie. Here we go. Oh, love it. Love it. And goodwill toward men and women. <laughs> Justin. <laughs> Batman Returns. There you go. <laughs> I was like, both of you guys like this movie, so I don't know who's going to win this one. I do like Ooh. that movie. I know, I think you both like it. Two, you both like it. Yeah. The only two I got were essentially bad movies. <laughs> <laughs> you have three points. The third one. You're doing, you you're three doing points. well here. This is essentially, this is essentially uh, <laughs> one was a Batman reference. <laughs> yeah. One was a Deadpool, and then one was a Batman movie. <laughs> yeah. You got okay. It's all coming up roses for this guy. Yeah, yeah. So Justin, let's Matt I makes a hell of a comeback I'm, here. I'm fucked up next. with this stupid game because I, I'm like, 
I gotta remember it's the last line, and I'm last line of the movie, right man. I, I, I know. Last line of you know, that's because your parents gave you uh, vax. They, I, I'm anti-vax. <laughs> Anti-vaxed you, man. They fucked you over. Uh, here we go. No, fuck my tiny this little brain, man. This is a pretty easy one if you remember characters from the movie. Okay, here we go. Because one of the characters oh, boy, is, is named this in one. this line. Here we go. Yeah. One more thing, Sophie. Is she aware her daughter is still alive? Yes. Uh, Kill Bill Volume One. Correct. Look at this easy. I told you you get one. <laughs> I think Justin was going to bring in for that one, but he he gave. No, he, I, he, I thought it was so. He, sure. he, 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 he thought it was so. He gave me the. Uh, he gave me the um, the the Italian no, you, blanket. You beat me. No, you did. You beat me to it. I was thinking hard, hard. I was thinking hard. <laughs> <laughs> Oh boy! But look, I'm back in the game. I'm Let's gonna, do I'm another gonna... one. Let's do another oh. one real quick. See if I can get. It. All right, here we go. Oh, another another quick draw. Yes. Let's see. If we got another quick one. Another Buster Scruggs. I'm a New York <laughs> City girl. It's a little too quiet around here for me. Oh, this is a tough one. <laughs> is this like because I when I realized movies? this was the last line of the it's movie, I'm the, like, really? <laughs> one of those chick. This is one of those chick flicks. No. It is not. Chick with dicks? <laughs> That's why I was like, really? There's nothing chick flicky about this? Chick with dick? Yes. Chicks with dick movie? Mm. I'm in New York City, um, girl. It's a little too quiet around here for me. Who would be a New York City girl? Just a small town girl. This is a very hard one. Well, I don't th- I don't know if you guys are going to get this right. <laughs> they're not in New York City, obviously. Mm, yeah. They're not, no. they're not in Kansas anymore. They're so nowhere near New York. Here's a clue. <laughs> they are nowhere near New York City. <laughs> Nowhere. <laughs> uh, nowhere near New York City, huh? Mm-hmm. So probably somewhere in the desert. Mm, yeah. A little bit farther than the desert. <laughs> desert? Oh, wow. Atlantis. Is this like a, uh, <laughs> a little bit farther than Atlantis. <laughs> Atlantis. The moon. <laughs> a little bit farther than the moon. <laughs> Another galaxy. Shit. Mars. Close. Mars. Then you're getting warmer. <laughs> Jupiter. I'm a New York City girl. It's a little too quiet around here for me. So we're in yeah, space. I'm a New York City girl. We've established, so we've established girl. <laughs> Yes. I just want to is make this, sure I'm clear on that. Is this okay. the um, movie we were just talking about today? Um, the one from the... <laughs> Very is difficult it, uh, one. This is, not, this is not an easy one. This is a hard one. This yeah, this is, it's it. Uh, what's her name? Seventies uh, uh, chick. Uh, Mil- no, no, this is not Jupiter ascending. No, Jupiter ascending. No, don't even go there. Descending. I would never put Jupiter ascending on this list. <laughs> I thought you would probably put it against a fuck with us. No, no, these are all movies that you know of, <laughs> that you've really. Yeah, you know of Venom. Probably That's about seen. the most stretchiest album. Yeah, I've, I've heard of them. <laughs> Jupiter Ascending. I don't think I don't remember any lines from that movie. <laughs> is this a Marvel movie? No, but it is no. a comic book movie. <laughs> comic book? Of course it is. Everything's a comic book movie these days. Except for it's a DC movie. Mm, I don't know if it's DC or Marvel, but it is a oh. comic movie. I am a New York City. We don't even girl. know if DC movies are DC movies. It's a little too quiet around <laughs> here for me. I'd have to check the origins of this uh, certain character to see what uh, me, huh? their comic book was. Studios. I'm a New York City girl, huh? I'm a, it's a little too quiet around here for me. Oh, God. This is oh. the last line of the movie, if you don't count. Which makes me think that there was a sequel to this, maybe. I wish there was. <laughs> I oh. wish to God there was. Is John Carter? <laughs> John Connor? No, no, no. Not John Carter. Why the hell John would I want Carter. a John Carter sequel? <laughs> <laughs> Fuck no. <laughs> Who wouldn't? Anybody like with those. a brain? <laughs> I like them. Oh, really? Wow. I don't know, man. I'm just throwing them out now. <laughs> I, I, I don't know. I'm just, the answer. Movie, you guys give up? You guys, you guys, anybody get the buzzer with a question? Yeah, I don't. I guess. Fucking no. Yeah. Fucking yeah, clearly. Uh, yeah. The answer is I, the, <laughs> the, the answer was Flash Gordon. Okay, here we go. I am Sam. No. <laughs> yeah, I am Sam. The climax <laughs> in was space. It, what was it? Flashback. What was what? it? The Flash? It was Flash Gordon. Oh, it was Flash, Flash Gordon. Gordon. Yes, yes. Oh. <laughs> Well, I only remember Queen. That's all. I remember. <laughs> yeah, I remember. Ajax I approaches. I've never seen that movie through the end. All right, here's a, here's another. Uh, this is not tough, but this is a no- this one's for all the marbles. Yeah, yeah, yeah I it guess whatever. Marbles here. Uh, this I got two more. I got three more, and then why are you so down, Matt? Why are you so down, DJ? 
Because yeah. I thought you guys would get down. Venom of all fucking movies. And I'm like mad at myself. Why would, why would you list. expect that out of I never I don't know. saw it. I don't yeah, know. <laughs> either of us have. I thought I'd be the That's only terrible. one that saw Venom last, but apparently I was not. <laughs> no. I didn't want to see it. The problem you was to. I didn't want to see it. I saw it like recently, so that's why. All right, here we go. See, I do I do want to see it. I, I gave you a really good clue. I, I did the Venom voice and everything. Okay, here we go. I know. It was good. But you were good. Yeah, you you were, were good. Did the you, you were better than Tom Hardy. I thought I was talking to Tom Hardy. Well, you know, he's not in that scene really. But All right, well, technically, yes, he's the voice. All right, here we go. This is a hard one, but it's, it's technically an easy one. You just got to remember a movie, but you guys... It's hard know. but fair? It's hard but fair. Here we go. Uh, a bit of both. This is a movie that we've both seen? Probably, you've, all, maybe. You've, you've seen it. <laughs> you've seen it. Yeah. Well, if you haven't seen this movie, but I'd be The trick stunned. is, have I seen this all the way through is the uh, issue. I mean, have I seen the whole movie? It's, it came out a while ago. It's a comic book movie. There's another clue. A bit of it's both. It's a movie. movie. It takes place in space. Uh, it, yeah, of course. It does take place in space. Uh, yeah. It's a I space just, film. A bit I just of, really can't remember if it's the first or second bit one. Of <laughs> a bit of both. A bit of both. A bit of both. Uh, Here, I'll say one and you say one. <laughs> I, I, don't, I don't even know what you the first know. one is. He's not, he's, uh, on, he's not on your same train of thought right now. I'm not understanding. Yeah, I, I don't. I can't even think right You're now. You're closer. Things are, I think. Is, you, I think Justin's. In the, he's trying so, to figure so it's out. in. It's in space. It takes place in space it's and has two movie. films with it. That's a pretty big clue. I just gave both of you. It's a comic book movie. Comic book movie. It's in Thank space. You, DJ, you're like our guardian. Oh, yeah. oh. <laughs> but which one am I? <laughs> okay, I fine. Know. Okay, I guess. Okay, Dustin and I will say the same. <laughs> at the same time, we'll say something at the same time. Okay. All right, ready. <laughs> <laughs> Guardians, Guardians one. of the Galaxy Part 2 Gar- <laughs> Guardians Part 1 Part 2? <laughs> Matt got it right part one. <laughs> <laughs> ah. <laughs> Matt wins <laughs> Or vol- uh, Volume 1 should I say? It's no, Volume, volume, one. Guardians volume of the Galaxy. 1 yes. Oh Justin <laughs> <laughs> Too late you son of a bitch <laughs> Uh, I have two more. One of them is super easy. One oh, of them is man. super hard. So we'll just, I'll go with the easy one. Let's go the easy route. Let's go the easy route. It's in a galaxy. I think, how we, I think we know how this game's going to go. Yes. Uh, well, the people who listen to this podcast are like, you fucking moron. <laughs> it's hard when it comes down to it. It gets hard. Yeah. <laughs> okay, here we go. I'm finished. That's finished. <laughs> was that was that just me giving up? No. Yes. <laughs> uh, kind of, sort of is. So, yes. Yeah. Uh, there will be blood. Ah, that's right. Okay. <laughs> What's your score, Matt? Do you have three or four? Uh, three. It's three to three now. Three to three. Wow. Somehow, somehow, <laughs> somehow I don't Matt know how, <laughs> but in some way, it's, it's been a massive epic comeback. One for all the marbles. Here we yeah. go. Wow. Down to the I could do here. this really hard one, but I don't even know if you've seen these movies, so I, I, I'm going to move. It's it's uber popular. Clearly, we haven't. If you clearly haven't seen haven't Venom movie. or Deadpool, yeah, clearly. Uh, I don't think you've yeah. seen this movie. <laughs> no, I haven't seen a movie since 1978. Oh, my God. Uh, <laughs> Jesus Christ. All right, let's do it. All right, I haven't killed a man since 1984. I haven't killed a man since 1984. Oh man, should I even do this one? Hold on, let me see if I can. Do I have another one? Oh Christ! Come on, <laughs> just give the give give the hard one. Give the hardy. All right, you're not gonna get this one. Here we go. Okay, well Justin will. Ow! Don't make me Thanks. laugh. <laughs> what? Ow! Don't make me laugh. Uh, ow! Don't make me laugh. That's the line. Ow! Don't uh. make me laugh. <laughs> Never gonna get it. It's very hard. I feel like this is a line from a movie that they're talking while there's a lot of loud music happening at the same time. So the last line. Well, it's is the last line of a movie. So loud chances audio are edit. music would be playing. It's the last line of the movie. <laughs> but not somebody, music doesn't shot. always play in the last line. Of I feel a like somebody shot. Somebody's very very. Hurt. Oh, I think I know what this is. Ooh. Yes. Be lethal Weapon 2? <laughs> it's funny. That line is said in that scene, but it's not the last line of that movie. 
I, oh, as soon as I thought about it, no. I was like, oh, wow, that is said in that movie. I'll, you know what? I'm going to give you a pass because that's not the last line of the, the movie. But sure, I'll give it to you. <laughs> the line was from Mission Impossible Fallout, which was actually the last line of the movie. But I'm going to give it to Matt because... <laughs> oh. No, no, that's not fair. <laughs> Because they pa- that's not fair. They pan up, and I think I won it. I don't think it's fair. I think Danny Glover says yeah, another and line. I lost, and I think it is fair. So, <laughs> <laughs> I remember they say he, he goes, "Oh, Raj, don't make me laugh." Oh, oh. I'm not sure if he says. I don't know. I, I'd have to double check if that's the last line of the movie. So I think he says, "Raj, don't make me laugh." But whatever, I, I give it to you because it's close enough. <laughs> I don't think it's fair. I don't know. I'm, I'd have to I'm, rewatch I'm, the Look at the Weapon 2 I'm, because I'm going to rescind this win. I know he says that, but I think he says, oh, Raj, don't make me laugh. But I know in Lethal uh, Mission Impossible Fallout. That's why Fallout. it's wrong. It's incorrect. I, but I don't know. It might be correct. I don't know if he says, oh, so Raj. It might, thought, it's probably not. I don't know. Mm. See, I thought Mission... I thought Mission Impossible. She touches his ribs or something. He does. He, she does, she says something like "You look good" or something. He's like, oh, "Don't make right. me laugh," or "Ow, don't make me laugh." But I I don't know what Riggs says in that yeah. scene. I know they pan up and they say something else, but I can't remember. Like, I'm gonna. It's close enough. I'm gonna give it to you. Uh, well, <laughs> all right. Thanks for the cheap win. Well, cheap. You made a four I'm point comeback. <laughs> it's not that cheap. I wonder how that happened. What a shock. I'm only gonna commit suicide after this, so it's not a big feel, deal. Feel, I feel like uh, I feel like Tim Donahue had something to do with this uh, win for me. <laughs> Tim Donahue. <laughs> That's a weird. I bet on the Jew. <laughs> Five bucks on the Jew. <laughs> Five bucks on the Jew. This has been simplistic last lines. The proverbial line in the sand that we regrettably crossed. You're not dead until I tell you. You got that. You're not dead until I tell you. You're not dead until I tell you. You got that, Riggs? You're not dead until I tell you. You're not dead. You're not dead until I tell you. Like a nagging wife. I breathe. This is why I hate black people, Roger. You're all the same. You know what's funny? After the end of this movie, they both should have went to prison for like 30 years. Could they kill the diplomat? They killed 30 diplomats. <laughs> well. Son of yeah, a bitch. Were <laughs> I thought you were dying here in my house. You were dying, man. <laughs> here it comes, here it comes, here it comes. Here it <laughs> Where are they? Are they all gone? Bad guys, you get them? Bad guys, they're all dead. (laughs) 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 They're the Catherine (laughs) Nathan. Hey, Raj. Did anyone ever tell you? What? You really are a beautiful man. Oh, well done. <laughs> Give us a kiss before they come. <laughs> <laughs> Give us a kiss before they come. Oh, there you go. Oh, it is! It is! You got it right! Wow, look, look at that. Go. Look at that. It's, you said, Al, don't make me laugh, isn't it? Is that what you said? No. Oh, it? Matt got it right. Look at Stuart. You got it right. I didn't even know I got it right. Got it right. Look at <laughs> that was perfect. Look at that. Look at that. So you you think Mission Impossible Fallout made a callback to Lethal Weapon Two? You know what really is funny though? Hmm. That is the last line in another movie. What? Ow! Don't make me laugh. Yeah. What movie? What I just is thought it? of it? What? Thunder Force. <laughs> 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 oh my god guys it all comes around it all is all right matthew give everybody your information <laughs> oh boy uh ew, ew, simplistic maybe used simplistic put your, push your glasses up Michael with your finger there you go there you go there you go uh yes yeah. mm-hmm. <laughs> this was the simplistic reviews podcast master Wayne. a podcast the size of, of a pandering <laughs> Go to simplisticreviews.net. I can't do this fucking Michael Caine thing. <laughs> this Michael Caine voice? I can't, can't say go size. to Stitcher. 
Size of a tangerine. <laughs> Spotify. Simplisticreviews.net. <laughs> Go to Spotify. ITunes. Go to Stitcher. <laughs> Tune in radio. Stitcher. <laughs> Go to iTunes. Twitch. Go to Instagram. Instagram. Facebook. Go to the Grandmaster Wayne. Tw- tw- Twitter. <laughs> Twitter, you Twitter, blow the you bloody, bloody doors Twitter. off. You bloody bloody t- and go to Twitter. <laughs> I blew her bloody doors I ble- off. Master Wayne, ma- listen to me. Master Wayne, listen to me. I uh, blew her bloody doors off. Can you believe? <laughs> can you believe they're making a movie that's like Dirty Rotten Scoundrels? Oh my God, I forgot about this fucking movie. I almost spit up it's my fucking movie. beer watching the trailer. It's <laughs> a movie. <What? laughs> it's a movie without me. And Steve Michael Martin, Kine. he was a good chap. A good chap. He's a good chap. Good <laughs> chap. Rupert, where's the bathroom? <laughs> I took a shit the size of a, of a tangerine. You want to see me take a shit the size of a tangerine? You go to Patreon and give us a dollar. I'll give you a dollar for every rugby you give me. Because it's good sport. Because <laughs> it's good sport. Because I want to see the internet burn. <laughs> And can you believe they're making dirty rotten scoundrels without oh, me? What the fuck is the name of it? And I'm gone. <laughs> and I'm spent. <laughs> what is the name of that movie? What the fuck is the name of it? Somewhat dirty <laughs> rotten. Oh jeez. <laughs> Something smells dirty and rotten. The only way to make that movie worse is if, if for Matthew is if Anne Hathaway's in it. Oh shit, she is. <laughs> oh, Anne Hathaway. Oh, she's a fine lass. <laughs> And by last, I mean ass. <laughs> she puts the, the ass in last. Well, for uh, Michael Caine, <laughs> Donald Trump's Trumps, and uh, <laughs> Trumps, 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 Trumps. That sounds like a cereal brand. <laughs> I'm the- yeah. What's for dinner tonight? Uh, we're just through some Trumps. Trumps, Trumps. Trumps. It's Trumps. What's for dinner? Uh... Again? God yeah. damn it. Can we get some food this time? Again. <laughs> hey, Mom, what's to... for drink? What's to drink? A bit oh, of both. We got purple stuff. <laughs> a bit uh, of both. And we got Trumps. We got a bottle of Trumps for you. Frosted Lunky oh. Trumps. They taste like shit. <laughs> oh. This is what we deserve. This is this 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 was 220 years in the making. <laughs> in the making. He's not the he's not the hero we deserve. <laughs> he's not the hero we need. He's the hero we deserve. He's the, he's the hero, hero we hero need we and need. deserve. <laughs> he's the hero we're stuck with. He's, he's the hero that Why we got. Why is he running, Dad? I don't think he's, a hero. he's a drum son. <laughs> he just, just took a dime. Look trumpet. away. <laughs> he's the fart knight. Yeah, he just took a trump. <laughs> he's the fart knight. <laughs> he's the fart knight. Get your trump away from my family. <laughs> Stop putting that gun on my family. <laughs> Trump. <laughs> you wouldn't Trump. Trump. You wouldn't Trump if you knew what I lost. <laughs> Stop wearing that gun on my kid. Stop trumping that gun on my family. <laughs> Stop trumping on my family. <laughs> I have to trump on him. You. I have to do it. <laughs> All good things must come to an end. Which is probably why the Simplistic Reviews podcast continues on. Month after month. Year after year. Perpetually popping up on the limited timeline you call life. Marriages. Presidential terms. The lives of good people. All eventually reach finality. But the Simplistic Reviews podcast just keeps going. And going. And going. This podcast going. is a proud member of and the going. Lamb Podcasting and Network. Going. Find the network and at largeassmovieblogs.com. Whoa! Oh. Say and going one more time, and we'll be hearing from Energizer's lawyers. And going. Da- Hello. Hi. Hi, lawyers. 